Hey, taking a live look outside with our Chatham Parkway Skycam. Kind of a broad look over all of Savannah there. With the, see the bridge in the background? We are just to the right of that at Plant Riverside District. And, you know, we're talking all about Navy Week this week, and homecoming has become sort of a theme for Navy Week in Savannah this year. Ensign Badger, who we met earlier, not the only one returning to familiar surroundings this week. Commander Cheryl Collins and Lieutenant Sharice Fogel are also Savannah natives that are in the natives, the Navy's traveling party for this week. Good morning. How are you? Good Colin? morning. And I will also say to you both, welcome home. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you. Well, let's talk a little bit about Navy Week first. Uh, but just this is a great opportunity for you to engage with people, isn't it? Absolutely. is to come back home for some of us and to get <laughs> to meet the people and tell them what the Navy does for them. Your taxpayer dollars pay for what we do, and we want to showcase what you're paying for. Right. And you're going to be able to meet some family here because uh, a lot of your family is still in Savannah. Yes, my whole family is here, born and raised in Savannah. I'm super excited to get a chance to be with them. Fantastic. And uh, Jenkins High School? Jenkins High School and Savannah State University. And Savannah State. So. True Blue Savannah? Absolutely. In the JROTC program? The JROTC and the ROTC unit at Savannah State. Oh, wow. Excellent. So you knew early on that Navy was a career for you? Absolutely. The Navy's had me since I was probably 14 years old. Wow. And Commander, how did you come to the idea of, of this is something that you want to do for a lifetime? A little different for me. I'm in the Navy Reserve, and so a little later on in life, I was like, I think it'd be really cool to take my civilian skill set, which is video production, and do it in the Navy. And so I found out about the Reserve, and I've been doing it for about 15 years best two jobs ever. Wow. Background in video production, by the way, and also a little experience with WTOC in yes, your Yes. I actually <laughs> was an intern, a college intern here at WTOC at Chatham Parkway wow. years ago. Doug Weathers was Worked there. Doug Weathers. Dawn Baker was there when I was there. She wow. wouldn't remember me, but I was running the <laughs> teleprompter and learning what they do. It was wow. so much fun. Great experience. Set me up for success. But the, the Navy pulled you away from a career yes. in television. Yes, it did. <laughs> in a good way, though. Join the Navy, see the world. I'm sure that is uh, that is very true, isn't absolutely. it? We hear that as a slogan, but it's uh, just absolutely true. where have both of you been? We have been all over the world. Um, I've been to Japan, Dubai, Spain, Greece, um, countless countries. It's amazing what the Navy's done for me. And I just got off of a ship three weeks ago. I was on the USNS Mercy, a hospital ship, and I went to the Indo-Pacific region. So we went around doing humanitarian uh, assistance missions there. So I got to see all these island nations that were important in World War II that I would have never been to. Amazing. You mentioned that you were in the reserves. How yes. is that different than active duty? So it's really, the reserves are very integrated with active duty these days, so it's really how much time I want to give. We have a minimum, like one week in a month, two weeks out of the year, but really I, I have flexibility in my job, so I say more, like, more opportunities, here I am, let's go. I'm, I'm going to ask you for a little education on your actual title because you are a lieutenant select. I'm a lieutenant commander select. So, I was, bigger one. so I was recently uh, selected on a promotion board in August, and I'll promote to lieutenant commander 04 in September. Hey, well, I, I can't have two Navy folks here and not point out that we have a ship going out by <laughs> behind us. Uh, uh, probably as big as we think those are, they probably are dwarfed by the ships that you are on. <laughs> Mine was huge. It was enormous, and you would literally get lost on oh, it yes. the first few days. Well, well, again, welcome home. Thank you both for your service. Uh, have a great time during Navy Week in Savannah. Hope you get to meet up with some family. Yes. <laughs> and shout out to my Aunt Judy. She's watching right now. <laughs> Fantastic. And, and maybe shout out to the folks at WTOC. Oh, yes. And there. hello, <laughs> Don and everybody there. Thank you both so much. Thank you for here. having us. I appreciate it. All right, when morning break continues, we're going to get another performance on the Navy.